Wish your artwork looked a little more lifelike? Just go over your lines with a 3D pen. Looking good, right? Just like real hair on our head. And once the colors come in, that's when things get really interesting. Don't worry, I'll draw the mouth on top. Right after I color in this amazing outfit. The more colors, the better, right? And that's how it's done, people. 3D coloring at its finest. I can even pick her up! Hi, mister. In you go! This is gonna be so perfect! Ugh. <sighs> made it on time. Hi, Matthew. Emily! <laughs> no time like the present! Wait, what is that? She already has this toy? What are the odds? Oh, what can I give her? These earbuds? Oh yeah! <laughs> Just have a couple things to do first. Safety first! <laughs> Here goes nothing! Oh! Oh! Ouch! Gah, oh, yep, still rolling! Oh! That was a rough ride. But I've got business to tend to. Clean space, please. What's better than a gift? A personalized one, of course. And this thing's sure to be one of a kind. Just gotta fill all the white space. There, that's good. Now to paint a face. Good thing I've got lots of blue. It's his favorite color, after all. Now for the little details. It's really coming together, huh? Don't forget the white parts! They're just as important here. Perfect! Now for a few final touches. And we're just about finished! So cute! But… Ha! Just one more step. With just the right placement, comes alive! Isn't it perfect? Let's try this again. Hey! It's just for you! <laughs> no way! It matches my guy perfectly! How did you find something like this? <laughs> oh. What? I almost forgot. I got you a gift, too! Do you love it? <laughs> okay, time for hugs! I love being besties! Okay, I think I've got this level locked down. Here I go, the final treasure run. I can do this! Hmm? What's he doing over there? He's pretty excited. I'm so close to winning this dungeon! Could I have a chance? Huh? Oh no, I'm playing right now. Please? Ugh, I already said no! I'm playing! Please, please, please! I said no! <laughs> well, fine then. You don't have to be so mean. <sighs> and I'm out of my drink, too. Great. Listen, I'm watching you. Don't touch my game. I'm watching you. Don't touch my game. What a grouch. Alright, he's gone. Now's my chance. <laughs> he shouldn't have left it alone. He thinks he's so great at this game. I'll show him. Yeah! I'm awesome at this! He's not nearly as good as me! <laughs> Take that! And that! How about this move? <gasps> oh! Oh no! I knocked off his mug! Oh, there it goes! Oh. <gasps> no! It totally broke! What am I gonna do? He's totally gonna know that I was playing his game! Wait a second. I know! All right, Mug, you're coming with me. And now to use my 3D pen. This is gonna solve my problem. I'll just trace the edge of this broken lip. Okay, okay, so far this seems to be working. I have to keep going. Now up to the top of this side of the break. And now to go across. It's like stitching it closed. Or making a patch. It's gonna need a lot of lines, though. It doesn't have to be perfect right now, though. It's more important just to get some base lines put down. Okay, almost done, and… Here we go! Phew! I think I fixed it. It's the best I can do anyway. Oh no! He's coming back! I need to get out of here! Quick! Back to my chair! Phew! Made it! Hmm. You're being suspicious. I'm still watching you. Hmm. Something doesn't seem right around here. I feel like there's something amiss. Huh. Guess there's nothing. Alright, time to fill my mug back up. 
Gotta remain hydrated if I'm gonna win this level. Ah, so good. Uh, is he gonna notice? Wait, what the heck is on my mug? <laughs> well, guess she had nothing to do with it. Doesn't matter. Back to my game! Hold on, dad! I need something! Oh, she didn't even notice, huh? Forgetting something? Oh, thanks! Let's go! Ugh, I can't find them anywhere! Nope, not in here! What? My keys! You lost them again? Let's go look. Nope. Did you look under here? Let's look under the couch! Anything? No. Hmm. Well, let's think here. I don't have them, do I? Oh, nasty. Ugh, yikes. I don't know where else to look. Wait a minute. Now hold on to these, missy. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Wait! Did I remember the keys? I can't see anything in here! Ugh! My nightstand! Oh man! Dad? Let me in! This story has taken an interesting turn. Ugh. This is hopeless. Guess I'm stuck out here. No one ever takes out the trash. Ava? I forgot my keys! Again? Oh boy. Is that all your stuff? That gives me an idea! I can use one of your puzzle pieces to ensure you never lose your keys. Once the piece is all covered, put the first letter of your name on top. All done! Now you'll never miss these! Here you go! Hey! They have an A on them! Thanks, dad! Oh! Dad made one of these too! And don't they look cute together? I have the best dad ever! Works like a charm. Delivery for Miss Julie. I hope you love it, darling. I wonder what this could be? Oh, One of those fancy hairbrushes! I can't believe he remembered I wanted this! Finally, a man who listens to me! And check out this sweater! No tangles here! You like that, planty? That's the spot! What's up, Julie? Huh? Was it windy outside? Cause your hair's looking a little tangled. Nothing to see here. Just a few more strokes here. Julie? What am I, a poodle? Anyway, nothing like a good brush. Oh, a bad tangle? Good! Out! <gasps> My fancy brush! Leo's gonna totally break up with me! Aw oh, man, but I know just how to help you. Oh yeah. I'll try anything! Missing some bristles? Just make some yourself with a handy 3D pen. But be warned, this may take a while. That's better. Bristle City, baby! Now isn't it just perfect? I can't believe it! Thank you! See ya! Hey! That's enough! <laughs> What's up, babe? Your hair… Yeah? Oh! Don't worry, I got you! The brush! Yep! Oh! I think it's stuck! Uh, let's just go, okay? Just don't look in any mirrors. I need to finish my makeup and I'm ready. There. Looking good. Although, I need something around my neck. This scarf will do. Hmm. I'm not feeling it. It looks like a superhero's cape. How's that? Ugh, this isn't working. I can't wear this. Oh. I have an idea. 
I better put this shopping away. Oh, that's just what I need! Annie, what are you doing? I need this, please! This will look good. Or at least I thought it would. There must be something I can wear. Oh, maybe I could use these. How does this look? Ridiculous. What was I thinking? Ugh, what am I gonna do? It's so unfair. And now I'm gonna stress eat. Oh, these are good. What's wrong, honey? I just want a pretty necklace. Hang on. I think I have an idea! I wish I had thought of this earlier! This'll definitely work! Thanks, mom! Remove the bottom from a plastic food container. Write your name on a piece of paper and place the lid over it. Then trace your name onto the plastic. We don't need this paper anymore. Use scissors to cut around the name. Be careful here. We don't want any mistakes. Place it on a baking sheet and put it into the oven. The heat will cause the plastic to shrink. Wait for it to cool and remove from the oven. It's time to get creative. Paint over the plastic. Wait for the paint to dry. Then attach a chain. My own personalized necklace! Whoa! It looks amazing! I'm finally ready to go. I think I'll treat myself. Huh? How did that happen? Not this. This isn't gonna work at all. Absolutely not! This is terrible! Ugh. Ugh. My whole wardrobe is just the absolute worst! This is a disaster! Huh? What's going on in here? Ooh. I literally have nothing to wear! What are you talking about? Look at all this clothing! But Jake asked me out on a date! <gasps> Jake? Oh my gosh, what are we gonna do? Well, maybe this shirt could work? What do you think? Or maybe this red dress instead? Or is that too much? Uh, I'm not sure that's the best look. Wait! I think I just got a genius idea! I forgot I owned this cute crop top! Oh, but I don't have jewelry that will work with this look! Wait! I think I know what you can do! Huh? I don't get it. Oh, wait! Dad, you're so smart! I'm sure I've got something in here. No! There's nothing! This is hopeless! This date is gonna be the worst date ever! I should just cancel! Hmm, well, there's gotta be something we can do about this. I can't go out without a pair of earrings! I just can't! I'm not sure what I can… Wait! This neck pillow! And my 3D pen! Honey, I think this is the solution! <gasps> oh my gosh! I think you're right! Okay, I've got a little drawing of a watermelon slice, and now to trace it. I'll start with black ink and just outline all the way around the outside edge. And now to trace the lines on the inside, too. Okay, I think this is turning out well so far. I'm not done yet, though. I have to keep going. Time to start filling in the red watermelon color. Can't forget to do the edge in red, too. There we go. All the way to this end. Time for the rind. This green is a good choice. This is so fun. I should do this more often. I'll need a darker green here, though. And then I'll use the black color to do the melon seeds, too. Just little bits on the red parts. Yes! Just one more over here, I think. Woo! I'm done! It looks so good! I love it! And then, of course, I need to do a second one and add earring pieces. Eee! I can't believe how great these turned out! I absolutely love them! Let me try them on! They look good, right? Cute? Thank you so much, dad! Your smart idea really paid off! All right, I'm off to my date with Jake! All right, have a good time with Jake. Ah, now where's my neck pillow? There it is. Better. Wait, what's that? Oh, a photo. Aw, oh, look at that. She's having a great time. So cute. Oh, the doorbell! I'll get it! Shoot, we were in a groove! Look, it was a package! Yay! It's my new Crocs! They're beautiful! I love them! Wow! I'm so jealous! Mine are plain and boring. Hey! I bet I can fix them! 
I drew a cute little flower! And now for my trusty 3D pen! Two petals done, on to the rest! I prefer a back and forth pattern. And there! Now I'll use yellow to fill in the center. Aw, it turned out so cute! Next up, a strawberry. I'm gonna outline this one in black first. It's looking good! Now for the green top. And of course, red for the berry. This is gonna be adorable! And done! Next up, a star! I don't even need a template for this one. I can just freehand the outline. This yellow will make it look like it's shining brightly. There we go. Now it's time for the shoes. Think I'll put the star right here. Now for all the others. Yes! They turned out great! Time to try them on! Oh my gosh! I absolutely love them! <gasps> you did such a great job, Kate! Well, here. You can have it. Aw, thanks! <laughs> Want to see something really cool? Look what else I made! They slip right over the tops for a completely new look! I just used a 3D pen to trace the shoe. So cool! Oh, great! The dance! We can show off our new shoes, too! Hi, David. See anything you like? There's so much to choose from. I like this. Wow! These are so pretty! But I don't think I can buy anything. I'll just go. Bye. Maybe I should just make my own jewelry. I have everything I need in here. Let's have a look. Oh, this'll be useful. I'll thread the beads onto the string. This is trickier than I thought. Almost. Come on! I did it! Now I'll just tie it off. Ugh! Let's try this again. I'm pretty happy with that. Hmm. It's a little small. Maybe I can slide it over my hand. Okay, that's not gonna work. I'll need to stretch it. No! Not again! This is so annoying! That's it! Stupid bracelet! I just wanted something pretty to wear! Ugh! Huh? Where did these lemons come from? Wow! Look at that! There are so many! This gives me an idea! If you're a fan of fruit and jewelry, you'll love this! Cut a lemon into slices. Watch those fingers! Place the lemon slices onto a baking tray and place them in a warm oven. Cook the lemons until they've been dried out. Just like this. But these aren't for eating. Next, fill a container of liquid glass. Use a wooden skewer to dip the lemon into the liquid glass. Make sure the lemon is fully coated and let the excess liquid fall off. Place an earring hook through the hole made by the skewer. Do the same with the other slices. Wow! I love these! Mother Nature would be proud! It's time for me to earn some money! I'm open for business! Hmm… What do you think? I love them! I'll take a pair! Here you go! Hi, Ava! I love your earrings! Can I trade you? Of course! Here you go! Wow! I really wanted this! They're so cute! Mmm. So sleepy. Ouch! This is unbearable! like my eyelids weigh a ton! Look at this sleepy young lady! Who are you? Your sleepy godmother! First things first, we need to protect that head! Wait, I put my head in this thing? Hmm… I don't know… Maybe up here's better? 
I don't think I'm doing this right. Unless… Uh, uh, uh. Just do this. Oh, I bend it back and sit it up. Oh, this is gonna be great! Night-night! Mmm, oh yeah. Bye now. My job is done here. Ahem. There we go. Everyone looks pretty comfortable. That snoring is just <sighs> glorious. Finally, some peace and quiet. Perfect. Liam! Snacks ready! I know oranges are your favorite. No. Not before we wash our hands. You know the rules. They're clean, okay? Hey! Hands sink. Fine. This is ridiculous. But if she wants clean hands, fine. I'm using lots of soap, mom. Whoa! This thing sure is slippery. Hey! I can't get a good grip on it. No! Just forget it. I'll clean, see? I'm just so hungry. Oh, stay right there. <sighs> Time to tinkle. Whoa! Oh no! <gasps> Liam! Huh? What did I do now? I nearly fell on my head. <gasps> the soap! What's it doing down here? It's like it grew legs or something. Come on, stay up there. Wait a minute. I think I have an idea. A 3D pen can help keep your soap in one place. See all these squiggles? They'll all hold onto the soap for ya. Drawing them right onto the soap makes this thing the perfect shape. But we're not done yet. Use the pen to color in this illustration. We chose a unicorn. Use different colors to make it more dynamic. Simply release the color gel with back and forth motions. And voila! A unicorn! Check out this adorable soap dish! Put it in! And if it's nice and snug, nicely done! I'm keeping my eyes on you. Nothing's better than the swings. I'm coming for you, Claire! Woohoo! Look how fast I can run now! Nothing can stop me now! Thanks for watching! Whoa! My phone! Somebody better catch that thing! I got it! I got it! There! That was close. No! There better not be any scratches. Ever heard of using a phone case? But this thing is so dull looking. Personal preference. I know! If you want a super cute phone case, use a 3D pen to make a design. Can you guess what I'm making yet? I'll give you a hint. It contains lots of colors! Good thing I've got them all here. Now bring on the green. Lots of lines are key for this. And after green, I think I'll mix things up. With a pretty blue! Check out all these gorgeous lines! And now we're nearly finished. But how could I forget some sunshine? This could cheer anyone up! And once it's dry, put that baby on your phone! Check out my new phone case! It's not boring anymore, is it? I'm so proud! Now back to business! Have you learned nothing, Claire? Excuse me, I've gotta get into my locker. It's so weird that she's studying right here. Shoot, there's the bell. Hey, how did my skirt get caught in the locker? Oh, it's really caught in there. I better just yank it free. Ah, it yanked free of me instead! No, I better not try that. 
There's a huge hole! Wait a second. Yes! My 3D pen! I'm so glad I brought this to school! I'll just draw a cute little design around the hole in the skirt. Now to start filling it in. Gotta make sure the hole's covered. Okay, now for the next color. And to cover this part of the hole too. There! The hole's hidden! Now for extra details. I'll fill in the ears. And now for little eyes. Can't forget a nose and mouth either. Aw, the box turned out so adorable! The hole is hidden and my skirt's extra cute now! Oh, that looks cute. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> Don't do that! Hey, take a photo of me! Uh, okay. Yes, let me work on my poses. Uh, sure. Looking good. I'm a natural in front of the camera. Ooh, whoops! No! <sighs> that was too close. Hold on. My necklace has given me an idea! Keep your phone safe with this handy hack. Start with a length of thread. Next, you'll need a decorative bead. Place the bead onto the thread. Then add a different colored bead. Alternate the colors, filling the thread. Once you've done that, tie a knot in the thread and admire your new bracelet. But don't cut off the excess thread. We need to tie another small knot in it at the top, making a loop in the thread. Place the bracelet to one side. Next, you'll need your phone case. Place the thread through the hole in the side of the case. Pass the bracelet through the loop. Make sure it's secure. Then insert your phone into the case. Cute, fashionable, and practical. Pretty smart, huh? I just need to wear it on my wrist and it stops my phone from dropping. Whoa! Now can you take my <laughs> photograph? Oh yeah, that's it! That's a great photo! Though the wolf had sharp teeth, he also had a big heart. And so, when the princess stroked his fur, he laid at her feet. And from that day forward, they were always together. Oh, she fell asleep. I'll just tuck her in. Now to tiptoe out of her room. Oh no! That was so loud! Ooh, please don't wake up! Phew, she stayed asleep! Shoot, I broke her doll! She's gonna be so upset when she finds out! Darn, what am I gonna do? Oh, I know what I can do! Come here, dolly! Time for some repairs! Don't let me down, 3D pen! I really need you this time! I'm gonna try to make it look like fish scales! So the mermaid tail looks more real! And now for the fins at the bottom! Yellow seems like a good color to start with. But I'll use a bunch, because I want it to be pretty. There we go! Now for some finishing touches. A little more yellow at the top. And I'm done! Aw, that turned out really cute! I think she'll be happy with the results. I'm honestly pretty proud of myself with this. I'll just leave Dolly here for her to find. Sleep tight. Now to sneak out of the room again. The wolf wants cherry ice cream.